What's going on, everybody? This is Island Hopper TV Hotels coming to you from the Four Points by Sheraton here in Taipei, just near the airport. It's called Liquan, I think is the name of the area. Let me turn around the camera real quick. So you can see there is an actual train station. It's about a 15 minute train ride to the airport and uh, about a 20 to 30 minute ride by taxi. So it's definitely easier to get here by train from the airport and also uh, depart here to the airport, which is what I'm gonna be doing tomorrow, but it's a 7.30 flight, so I have to take a taxi. Anyways, just showing you the area here. They do have a pool, but it's closed because it is 9 p.m. It's on the third floor. But let me just show you the check-in area right here. And then here's the lounge. In case you show up early like I did. They do have an ATM there. I apologize for not doing this earlier. I had other work that I had to tend to, but I didn't want to miss the opportunity to do this. So I'm doing it now even though it's not the most ideal time for it. I'm doing this from my cell phone. Yeah, here's the bar. It is open nine o'clock. I will also show you my room. The room is the best part. I filmed that earlier. Here's where they do the breakfast. I think they do a buffet in the evening also. Yeah, so really a great hotel. I have nothing but good things to say about this place, as with many places in Taiwan. Here I got a spicy quesadilla. I know it's not Taiwanese food, but I've been eating Asian food for like the last three months, so I'm doing a quesadilla. She recommended it. Well, there's China Spice in the Grand Ballroom, but it's dark up here, so not too much to see. And here we are at level three, which is actually where the pool is. sauna too. Dang. Well, I can't get in there. It's uh, 10 o'clock. Well, I can't get in there. It's 10 o'clock, but it's out there. You can look at pictures on Google. Let's see if the fitness center is open. Well, you can see. I think the fitness center is open. It says 24 hours. Yep. That's good. How's the view? All right, so here's a look at my room here at the Sheraton Four Points. So they've upgraded me because of my titanium elite status. And I guess no one has bought this room, so they just upgrade. It's way too much room for me. <laughs> Look, there's a pool across the way there. I think that's a condo. There's the train. That's the airport express train. Take you from the airport to Taipei, which is the station is right across the street. So that's good. I mean, this is seriously like a presidential suite. Way too much for me, but uh, I'll limit my carbon footprint and enjoy it. <laughs> All right, look at the super let. Let's see what else they got in here. Okay, some vanity kit stuff. 
Bath is always good. Here's the shower. Oh, they've also got one up top. Do they have robes? Let's see what's in here. Whoa, a walk-in closet. <laughs> Nuts. That is legit. Okay. This is literally an apartment. Some shoes. Let's go see what else is around here. Yeah, so where else do you go where you see toilets that are like robots? This is actually a very simple kind of toilet. I've seen them much more gadgeted out, but you can see right here, you've got a thing on the wall that isn't Chinese. I don't know what it all means, but it's quite high tech. <laughs> Part of it has a toilet seat that goes up and down on its own, also flushes on its own, and then I believe there's a commode. Let's see what all these gadgets and gizmos are. I wish I knew exactly, but they're heated. It's a heated toilet, which is funny because this isn't Japan where it gets cold. <laughs> now time for my final review of the Sheraton Four Points in Taipei, right there near the airport. I would say I felt as though the price was a bit high, but for what I actually got, the room was great and well worth it for the $230 that it cost me. But if I was just getting a regular room at that location, uh, I'm not so sure that I like the location. The location is good. It's next to the MRT, which is convenient, but in the area around there, not too much going on, really. Uh, the mall, it's good, but not a lot of eating. I thought the restaurants were good, but the facilities overall, customer service and everything, customer service a five, the facilities a five, the room quality is a five, the comfort, but the location, a four. So overall, I'm gonna give it a 4.7 rating, okay? Hope you guys enjoy it. If you did, hit subscribe. Watch some more of our other videos from Taipei. We actually ended up going to uh, many different properties in Taipei, a Marriott, two, no, three Hiltons, and then uh, obviously the Four Points. Thanks for watching, we'll see you on the next one. You can also watch our Marriott Taipei and our Hilton Sinbon here at Taipei next by clicking one of those videos.